Hi. What's up, Buttercup? So, I just kind of want to go on a rant with you guys about swimming lessons. So, about three months ago, I um, reached out to my Facebook friends and said, where are you guys sending your kids for swimming lessons? Because I've always used, like, the local recreational center for swimming lessons. So, last year, my daughter, who was in level two, it was her first time doing, moving up from the animal classes, I always called them animal classes, the aquatic animal classes like sea otter and sunfish and all of those things to um, the levels. And I read in the handbook that if your child finished on a certain animal that you should put them in level two. So I listened to that and my daughter did amazing I thought and she failed level two. And I we were upset, but we were fine with it. If she has to repeat something, then it's better for her to get it right. So I reached out to my friends, where are they sending them? And um, maybe we'll try somewhere different. Because we weren't, we weren't all that impressed with the instructor. So some people recommended some other kind of private places in the area. And I called and they sounded amazing but it was around $40 per class and we were used to paying um, like 80 or $90 for 10 sessions. So um, I decided that we would continue with the local and we had to, to get both of my kids um, in programs together at the same time. We had to drive quite a distance um, for one place and we hemmed and hawed with doing private it was a little bit more expensive but we thought maybe it would be better for my daughter and they when we went to register they were all oversubscribed we were on a wait list so we continued and we did the classes so Friday we had our second last class and they gave us a heads up that my son, who is in Sea Otter, is not going to move on. And my daughter, who who failed last year, they want to move her up two classes, or two levels. So going from level two that she had to repeat to level four. And I'm kind of like, hold on, you overpaid 16-year-old. If she had a, if she had stayed in if she had have not failed level two a year ago and did level three this year, she would be in level four next next year. And it's kind of, or in the, at the same pace. And it's kind of like, it's kind of like, what, what was she lacking so bad that it, if now they want to move her up two levels? You know what I mean? And then my son who is in sea otter, I'm watching him every class and it looks like playtime. I'm kind of thinking like what what did he not sing did he not sing motorboat motorboat with enough enthusiasm? Like I don't understand how you can fail these play type classes. So message me in the comments if I'm totally out of line if you think that um my kid if you think my kid that's in the, the animal levels should have failed or if you think I'm not, I'm not in the right to be, the, to be upset about it, I guess give me a message or if you're, if you're really happy with a place and think that it's really worth it and that I should move on, write that as well. I'm interested in your thoughts. Thanks so much. Have a good day.